Hey guys, it's Sai. I'm standing here with my Ferrari at the loading dock because I have a flatbed on its way to come get her. It's been a year with the Ferrari and it's time to send her away. All right, you guys, the flatbed is here. I'm getting really sad right now because I'm really gonna miss my baby. <laughs> this is so painful because I'm so attached to my baby. I'm going to miss her. So this car has had problems since day one. Literally one of the, one of the most annoying problems was this like squeaking sound you hear when you drive. And it's probably because the back left caliper is actually sticking while you're driving. Not when you're braking, but while you're driving. So earlier I had taken the car to Ferrari service and they were kind of like unable to figure it out. They didn't really know what was happening, but it just like kept happening and it's just gotten so bad. But there's more you guys. There's a lot of electrical problems since day one. For example, you guys know how almost in any car when you get in, the seat slides into place, the like mirrors adjust and the wheel is supposed to actually like come down towards you after you're in your seat. So in the Ferrari, pretty much like the seat will slide, the mirrors will adjust, but the wheel gets stuck like a pie where it like goes after you turn off the car and it won't let you put it back down. Just like the electrical control to put it down, just like freezes. So pretty much what I have to do is either you drive with the wheel like awkwardly high or you kind of have to just like keep turning the car on and off until it decides to let you put the wheel down. And most importantly, transmission. I hate that we're having transmission issues, but it's happening and hopefully it can be fixed. So as you guys know, the Ferrari is a DCT, dual clutch transmission, and it's smooth like butter in a Ferrari. And it was that way when I first got it. But as I've been driving it more and more, and the car has like almost 9,000 miles on it, it's starting to feel really clunky, just like a single, like the old single clutch transmissions and you really feel it. Like it's like clunky, almost like Sammy the Lambo, like the ISR when it would like crack your head back. Like it's, it's not smooth, something is very off. And then there's the set of just annoying little things that are happening. Like for example, just think, you wash your shiny black Ferrari, it's shiny black, super clean, and then a bug splatters on the windshield. You go on the wheel to activate the windshield wipers and the spray that comes out and it just covers the entire front hood in this washer fluid. So the car is pretty much just super dirty again and you have to wash it again. And I feel like every car just has this other problem which is the tire pressure sensors. When it goes out, it's like the most annoying thing ever because you turn on the Ferrari and it's like beeping, beep, beep, beep. And you see that like red warning on the dash that's like tire pressure sensors, like not working. And it's just annoying. And since the car is one year old, it's also gonna have the one year maintenance done to it while it's pretty much in Ferrari service, um, which is changing fluids, changing oils. And I'll probably make a video once I get the car back just to go over like, what the results were for like everything that had to be fixed and what was done in the one year service. So stay tuned for that you guys. As you guys probably know, really nice, the service is actually covered for seven years by Ferrari. So that's awesome. So the car is crazy fun to drive. I put 9,000 miles on it in one year, but it's just like at this point, like the squeaking is just so annoying when you're driving it and like the transmission just like makes you it makes you feel like your teeth are gonna fall out, so. And I know what you guys are thinking. It's a Ferrari. Yeah, you have problems when you get a Ferrari. But same with the Lambo, my SV Roadster didn't have problems like this. So it's kind of new to me. Samosa, hi, good boy. Help, Pa? Clear. Pa? No? What's that? Oh, oh don't eat the mic. Let go, leave it. Oh no. Okay, say bye. Bye. <laughs> it's okay, Bear. You guys, he's really upset that the Ferrari isn't here anymore. He even tried to eat the camera, so it's okay. 
But anyways, I hope you guys have found this video insightful for what's going on with the Ferrari. And as always, don't forget to smash the like button, leave a comment, let me know what you guys think, and subscribe to my channel, turn on your notifications, you guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Oh, you woke up to say bye? <laughs> bye, guys. What's going on? Eat the mic again? Was it yummy? Yummy? <laughs>